Developing at 530, a man is finally facing charges for a murder Orange County deputies say he committed 30 years ago. Investigators say he admitted to attacking the man. Yeah, the suspect's own family also working with officers to help crack this cold case. News 6's Catherine Silver has the latest on the investigation from Orange County. Detectives here say John Stagner was a maintenance worker here in Orange County where he was found beaten to death. 30 years ago, his suspected killer, Ronald Cates, was identified as a person of interest in 1992. Deputies say that his family was key to solving this case. The Cates family uh, went above and beyond to be able to assist us. Detectives at the Orange County Sheriff's Office say Ronald Cates' family came forward to help solve a decades-old cold case, the murder of 53-year-old John Stagner. In 2020, actually, um, a family member of the Cates family contacted the sheriff's office and got this ball rolling again. Lead investigator Kevin Wilson says that effort led to more extensive interviews and the eventual arrest of Ronald Cates, who is now in jail in North Carolina. Arrest papers obtained by News 6 state that's where he allegedly confessed on body camera to the killing while hospitalized in April. He just explained more or less that uh, uh, he hit Miss, he hit Johnny with a with a stick. Deputies say they suspected Cates from the start, but they did not have enough probable cause to arrest him. At the time, they knew based off interviews with family members that there was a good friend, Ronald Cates, of the family that uh, borrowed several power tools, uh, other items from Mr. Stagner because he was a very giving man. He would not return these power tools back. Uh, he would actually pawn them for his own money. Um, to purchase drugs. The sheriff's office says John Stagner will be remembered for being kind and hardworking. They hope his family finally has closure 30 years after waiting for answers. Every homicide victim leaves behind family and loved ones and friends and that has an absence in their life because of these tragic crimes. Ronald Cates is facing a first degree murder charge. Deputies say he will be brought back here to Florida where he will be booked in jail. In Orange County, I'm Katherine Silver, getting results, News 6.